And up. Oh, hey, hey guys. Um, so uh, when you were walking in, uh, I'm not sure how we got on the subject. We're talking about magic, and I, I was talking about my favorite uh, magicians, uh, specifically Penn and Teller. Uh, they have a stage act over in L.A. Uh, not L.A. Las Vegas. Magic. Anyway, but yeah, those guys, magic guys, right? So uh, those are my personal favorite guys. But they have other guys like who's some other guys that Copperfield? Who's Copperfield. Co- yeah. Chris Angel. Uh, Chris. David David Copperfield. Chris. I mean Copper Copperfield. <laughs> Copperfield. Is he the guy who married Claudia Schiffer? No, he didn't marry Claudia Schiffer. No, he, yeah, I think he just cop a few. <laughs> he just cop a few. Um, Whoa. <laughs> hey. Cop yeah. And then he made uh, inappropriate touching. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so. Hmm. Um, yes. yeah, there's David Blaine. David's a very popular name in magic. This, magic. Yeah, but is, is Blaine actually, is that really magic? I guess hold is your. Is that really breath. an illusion to hold your breath? For like twenty minutes, I guess. Yeah. Uh, maybe. I mean, I guess if you're a dolphin, it's pretty much everyday, <laughs> everyday thing. Yeah. Chris I, Angel's I a magician. Chris Angel, yes, he's also. Dude, crazy. that guy is a total mind freak. Mind <laughs> uh, <laughs> freak. Um. Mind freak. Said mind. Never mind. <laughs> well, okay, David Copperfield, illusionist. Right? Yeah, he's he makes illusion. actually he makes the big what do you make the Statue of Liberty disappear? Statue of Liberty disappear. What, what walk, that, like, that was pretty much his I saw one of his like shows. That. Really good show, actually. Really, really good show. Yeah. I and walked then, through the wall of China and he did it in I saw him do it. It was great. David Copperfield, didn't he do the lady where it looked like she was floating in the air? Yeah. I saw her. I know how he did that. Oh. It was cool, great. aren't you That's special? Cool. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, that looks cool though. <laughs> no, and and but uh and, and okay, even Chris Angel, right? He does those even when things explode, he's oh, all like, it's a me, I'm emo, but things explode and all that stuff. It's still stunt, illusions, right? Stunt magic. Yes. Yeah, stunt, stunt magic. That's he good. does That's levitation. Okay. He does all the levitation. Then, I know how he does that one, too. And then, like, <laughs> public and stuff and like that. Got, That's neat. Teller, I think that's neat. They're, they're illusionists, but it's like, they're, they're like, a, it's like a stage show thing. And, okay, and then there's, and then there's David Blaine. Who I think the only thing that he's done is start a cult on South Park. Yeah, that's the only thing I know him for. Expelleramus. Expel. Speaking That's of, what I'd like to do to David Blaine. <laughs> Spell her on us. All right. Well, while we're on the subject, then my then, magic wand. Then there's then there's there's uh, uh, fictional Harry. fictional magic. Well, like like, like a Harry Dresden. Harry Dresden. Yes. Harry Dresden. One of Ooh. the coolest wizards, I guess. Ever. In, fictional wizards, I yeah. guess. Ever. Why? Why? Why do you think? Why? Okay. First of all, when you have a staff that is a hockey stick and a okay. wand that's a drumstick, <gasps> you're pretty awesome. You're a drumstick that's wand. just awesome. You know what? I want to see Harry Dresden go against uh, Gandolfini. <laughs> okay. Gandolfini isn't an actual wizard. That you no, yeah, no. He goes, you shall not pass. Yeah, uh, that guy. Gandalf. Gandalf. Uh, Gandolfini is not the wizard no, no, of no. which you speak. No, see, okay, well, this is what happens. When Gandalf, uh, what, remember, it's Gandalf the Grey. Right, then he died, and then he became Gandalf the White, but that means that it'd be Gandalf the Black somewhere. Hey, what color is Gandolfini's hair? Black. Dude, you gotta think here, man. It's Gandolfini is the young, uh, Gandalf. Uh, that was probably the worst <laughs> I've ever heard in my life. Um, what about Harry Potter? Harry Potter, <laughs> and, you know, Dumbledore, pretty cool. You know, I, I would like to see, uh, Harry Potter Take a shotgun to the face. Let's see what happens. <laughs> uh, nothing's gonna work. Your expelleramus mm, not gonna happen. Well, no, Ted an, Nugent. An expel- technically, an expelleramus. Ted Nugent. Yeah, Ted Nugent with his bone arrow is gonna take out. He doesn't have to be magic. It's Ted Nugent. <laughs> he's bad. I don't know when he starts playing the tunes. His licks are kind of magical. Is it? Is he Prince now? No. Ted Nugent is Prince. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh. Ted Nugent's a badass. But. Please, Mr. Nugent. Very Nugent. magical. Oh my god! Ooh, Sonic Screwdriver! Well, okay, I guess that would be magical because it's Sonic, but that doesn't make it less awesome. True that. That was awesome. Do that again? That was... Do that? <laughs> <laughs> I think I broke it! Other buttons. There, yeah. yeah, there we go! Woo! But, but it's Sonic. It should be laser. Because, I mean, who uses Sonic? This is cool. Yeah. Look, the who? The Who uses Sonic? What? Oh, the, do- the, Doctor Who! Yes. I guess you met the band. I was like, Peter <laughs> Townsend? What? They're not magic. Is it, have you seen what happens to his guitar afterwards? <laughs> and somehow puts itself back together at the end of each set? 
he wrecks the guitar, and next set, that there it is, back again, together. Almost as good as all for black. I, I, I suppose from your perspective, that would seem somewhat magical. However, I think the reality behind it is it's another guitar. Um, uh, no, that's, that's an illusion. Oh! 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 It's just feeding the illusion. It's like a new guitar. Um, that's a magical no, Okay, person. all right, so... Um, it, you guys can leave us a uh, some examples of some real life magic. For example, apparently Oliver Platt is uh, is magical, very why? magical. Why? Why? Wait. Why? Well, okay. Uh, he's in a movie with Matthew McConaughey, and every single scene, <laughs> Oliver Platt and Matthew McConaughey are in together. Somehow, Oliver Platt has kept Matthew McConaughey in his shirt. Somehow, it just—it's amazing. I, I for one, am astounded. Uh, that is th- okay. So it is established. Oliver Platt, magical. These kinds of comments, you can uh, give us some examples down in the comment section below. All right, comment. Nice. Uh, you can also uh, email us uh, as well. Um, otherwise, I think we got to get going uh, to the after party. Oh, sign up, driver. Oh, yeah, so as always, everyone remember to subscribe, and um, my, why are my nipples hard? Um, because they're magical. Where I don't you know where I left my minutes. wallet, but we better get going. Let's go. Oh, All right, okay. Later. Yeah. Woo! Oh, what?